that have consumed the Balkans for most of this century. But there's also general agreement among Western historians and diplomats that it was Slobodan Milosevic who unleashed the current wave of nationalism and ethnic violence. And in April 1987, Yugoslavia's communist leadership in Belgrade sent Milosevic to Kosovo, a remote mountainous region where the Serbian Orthodox Church had its beginning. Serbs call Kosovo their Jerusalem, and it was there in Kosovo that Milosevic reignited religious and nationalist passions throughout the Balkans when he threatened reprisals against Kosovo's Albanian majority. Virtually overnight, Milosevic became a hero to the Serbs, and six months later, their president.